guys so I have a Dollar Tree haul and you guys might be like a Dollar Tree haul like really girl yeah I know um you can find a lot of great drugstore makeup there that has either been discontinued from the drugstores and they need to sell it to somebody else that that can still sell it and make money so I thought I would show you guys what I got I actually got everything I have in this bag um, the whole total was $15. Everything in here is beauty related except one item that is a book. So I'm just going to go ahead and just throw that all the way. So my favorite author is Cornelia Funk, now that you guys know. And I happened to see, I happened to have seen this book there. And this book is, since it's hardback, let me see. Yeah, $16.99 is how much it would regularly sell for. I thought these two things were really kind of cool to find at the drugstore or at the dollar store because um I don't know I've never seen anything like this that would be at the dollar tree so um these are by skin nutritions um I don't know if this is just their own little line they have there but hey if it works I'm fine with it so this one is the green one and it says it, um is age defy ultimate dark spot corrector so um I'm gonna try it on my acne scarring I have or just, or just a little bit of discoloration I have on my skin. And I'll just show you what it looks like. Um, it just looks like a Garnier Fructis, uh, or not Garnier Fructis, but Garnier. Is that Garnier? It is Garnier. But you know what I mean. Garnier is like a roller ball and stuff. Like that's exactly what it looks like. So it's just got this metal ball on the top. I mean, it was a dollar. It says it's dark spot corrector. And if it doesn't work, I spent a dollar and I'm okay with that. So I'm excited to give this a go and let you guys know how I feel about it. Same for this one. This is to um, get rid of dark circles and puffiness under the eyes. It looks exactly the same. It's just in a red tube. And um, I already kind of like rolled this on my hand. But that's what this one looks like. And it's just a little red thing. Oh yeah. By the way, if you're wondering why I have a tank top on in the middle of January... Uh, it's because I just filmed a swatch video and I wasn't sure how far I was going to put it like up my arm or on my hand. So I stuck with a tank top. Um, but anyways, that's that. So I will update you guys on these in a short little video. And I picked up these two items. I already took them out of their packaging that they were in at the Dollar Tree. But um, they were just in like a paper packaging with plastic around it. These are two liquid, lip intense liquid colors. And that's what they look like. Um... They're just super pigmented. I will do swatches. I will do swatches of everything that I can. Um, so I just got these two shades because that's all they had. But I will be going back maybe tonight or on Wednesday. Today's Monday. Um, to go and see what else they have. Because sometimes they like... I think they get their trucks on Thursday. I know I'm crazy but you never know. Okay. So the first one I got is Fiery Coral. And it looks more of a hot pink to me instead of like a fiery coral. But it just like opens like this and it has a really nice doe foot applicator. Um, I personally think I was going to wear one of these because um, I was going to wear a white sweater. But I had to do a swatch video before this. So there's Fiery Coral. It just looks like a hot pink to me. It doesn't really look coral. Maybe a little bit but maybe it's more of a pink with a yellow base. They do have like a cosmetic smell. They don't smell good at all, but whatever. And then I have Pink Rave. Again, nice doe foot applicator. Very nice. Super pigmented. They're nice and glossy. I, they are not matte. Because um, I know that's like the huge rage right now. These ones are not matte. But I have been missing these glossy lips. So I've been wearing it quite often. So this is Pink Rave right here, and just a little bit deeper. It's more berry in the camera. It's looking like a fuchsia, but it's more berry. Like, you can see that kind of purpley tint there. It's a lot darker than the Fiery Coral, just so you guys know. And then, these were my last find that I found. I was super excited about. I actually got six of them, so I'll just go through the colors roughly. But I'm not going to swatch these because I just did a swatch video, which is already up, so I will leave it linked down below for you guys to go and check out. Um, it's kind of a swatch and first impression video because I was just opening it with you guys as I went. I didn't swatch them before that video. That was purposely swatched 
for that video. So I'm wanting to do a tutorial with these. If you guys want to see it, let me know um, by thumbsing up this video or commenting down below if you guys haven't done that in that video. Um, but that one's already up. Just go ahead and head on over there and watch it. It's a quick little video. I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, so these are the Maybelline Color Tattoo Pure Pigments. Um, it says... And that's what they look like. They're just in these little pots. This one is in Barely Brazen. This one is Downtown Brown. Breaking Bronze. Never Fade Jade. Wild Gold. And Pink Rebel. The last thing I picked up from there was a LA Colors Color Craze Nail Polish. I don't normally pick these up because I don't care for this brand, but I could not say no to this. These are like neon little flecks of glitter in here, and I think this would be so cute for the summertime. And I had to pick it up. Um, that's what it kind of looks like there. I don't normally pick them up because I don't really care for them that much, but this was too cute. I could not pass it up. That's everything that I got from the Dollar Tree. Let me know if you want to see these videos monthly and it'll be a bigger haul. Um, also, go ahead and go down there, hit subscribe, comment, and then go watch the video for the Maybelline Color Tattoo Pure Pigments. Um, it's pretty much just a first impression review and I kind of recommend the ones that I would tell you to go and buy. Um, those retail anywhere from $6.99 to $3.99 I've seen or $4.99 I've seen. So... Um, great deals at the Dollar Tree. You guys just have to look. If you guys did enjoy this video, thumbs up the video. Let me know what you want to see down in the comments, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.